Well, you said that young boy gave you a million dollars. And as long as you've been signed to NBA, he's never made a dime off of you. Uh, for sure. That's crazy. That, that, that's a different type of relationship right there. Well, I heard, I heard, and you know, free on thought, man, my God willing, he beat this case, you know, and sure a lot of that, but I heard young Young Thug ain't never made a dime off Gunner, and I Damn. salute the Gunner and Young Thug. Every the shit the media running with, I'm just saying me, like I ain't good. I me, I like Gunner. I'm just saying, I don't. You feel me? I just had to say that. But you said Young Boy is over loyal. Man, bro, young boy is a young, well, I feel like we grown, grown now, so we can't be talking and acting like we in our teens, but we in this, we from the same generation, bro. You know, everybody from our generation really got the same mindset. And you know, the ones who don't have a mindset like us, they very outstanding, but majority of this generation, 99 babies, 1999 and millennium babies, we think the same. And I feel like we the last generation of love and loyalty. That's how I feel. Well, 3860, the, the, uh, the mixtape that you got, with young boy. Now, when I talk about music, if you know me, I don't just gas people up. If I say something about what I feel about music, it's it's how I really feel. You listen to it? Yes, over and over again. And I'm gonna say that that is my favorite project that young boy has been involved in, including his solo projects. That was a classic right there. Y'all two sound so great together, and like I said, I'm not just saying this because you're in front of me. I always tell people that I ain't saying this because you're in front of me. Yeah. I'm not just saying because you're in front of me. I love that project. Y'all two sound, y'all like Kobe and Shaq together. So, appreciate it. Great project. Appreciate it. But I remember young boy said that he, he didn't want to drop that project for a while. What was the reason for that? Man, it be some projects I don't be wanting to drop for a while, man. Blast. Sometimes in this music industry, you got to understand, man. And and when I say this, maybe a, a, a hundred other artists, uh, be, they might not put it out there, but I know they going to feel this. Certain stuff go off feelings. Like, I feel like you don't need to drop right now. I feel like we need to do this, 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 and this, this, and this, this, and this. Then when I get that feeling, this one we need to do it. Mm. So it was that. It was just it was art artistically, like, timing-wise, it was that. Because I thought the music was, yeah, was right it, there. Yeah, it was something like that. Just thinking like an artist. Okay. That's it. Why be going through his legal problems right now? He just pled guilty. Got his 27 months. He still got his other case. Have you guys talked? Yeah, I ain't hardly, I don't hardly that talk while he was in jail. Man, talk. <laughs> he in, he, last time I hollered at him, he in the cell still trying to give me stuff. <laughs> I'm like, man, talk. You in jail, man. I can't. You feel me? Bruh, a lot of people walk, probably wonder why Top and myself and a couple more people, they probably wonder how we always dodge stuff. Because sometimes in life, when your heart weighs more than your soul, bruh, you going to forever be blessed. That's why he always come out on top. That's why I like the name Top for him because I noticed something, man. And I just was recently talking to some family members about this. 
The tongue is a powerful thing. A title is a even more part. Uh, the title that you have for yourself is an even more powerful thing. Because his name Tom. That means he gonna always come out on top, always be on top. It's not. It's not the top. Is is, is where it's at. Now, people who out here who name themselves Demon Kid and <laughs> you putting that title on you, you inviting that energy. So when you get in something, it's gonna be some demonic energy, and it ain't gonna work out how you want it to work out. So, man. That's another thing I noticed about him. Man, it's like, man, he know how to maneuver and he know how to stay on top. Like, you mean he not a dodge? You mean me? Yeah, man, free YB. 